Hello everyone, I'm Cimentos Ken, that's Buff Bro, and today we're checking out Extreme Love, 83 year old swipes Tinder for toy boys. Ooh. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm on Tinder to find young lovers. I'm comfortable, not wearing underwear though. Ah! <laughs> that, yes, yes sir. <laughs> that is what we like to call the Tinder special, you know what I mean? It's the Tinder relay, no she's underwear. coming in hot. Oof. 83. Wow. 83 years old and you know, looking for love in all the right places, right there on Tinder where, you know, they, they can, if you're into that kind of thing, you can swipe whichever way you got to swipe because I've never used twin, tw Twinder, Tinder, I have no idea. <laughs> uh, before we continue this video, hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. Check out Dane on Buff Pro on the YouTubes. Check out the Toasty Games channel if you want to see us play some games and do some live streams. Do all the do all the things that help all of it because, yeah. yeah, it all helps. And couch game. Couch. <laughs> Hmm. If it seems like it's going to be good, we'll go right up to my apartment. Dang. How are you? Straight <laughs> to it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Dang. Wow. All right. Jeez, lady. Okay. <laughs> Ask her if she's got her life alert ready just in case. <laughs> <laughs> got my bottle of water and life alert. Let's go. I'm 83 years old. Oh, Hattie. I think I know more about males' genitalia than any doctor. I may not know more than a gay man, but okay, all right. She she knows she knows about him. Wow. She knows. You yeah. know, you got you got something going on. She can she can prescribe you something. She knows She's better than a doctor. <laughs> she knows him inside and out. Ooh. Is seeking a steady younger friend lover for a shared life of adventure and passion. No pro Trump. And no players. <laughs> She's like, no hey, you like Trump. Trump. You like Trump? Get out of here. <laughs> you trying to play me? You get out of here too, because I'm the one playing the games. Yeah. All right. I'm pro Joe, and I'm the player. <laughs> That's old Hattie right there. I like it. <sighs> Shoot, her no Joe probably about the same age. <laughs> Do you only date younger men? Well, first of all, most men my age aren't around anymore. Oh, yeah. They're not afraid. Well, sometimes they'll lose an erection because something goes wrong, but they get off on getting a woman off. Very different from when I was younger. Oh! Wow. Sounds like, yeah, like all this relationship talk. It's just about smashing. It's about clapping <laughs> cheeks, you know? You know, back in her right. day, you know, getting oh. it on was just about having a baby and, you know, making the family bigger because you know, they had to make it to the Great Depression and all that. But now, it's different. <laughs> now she gets to enjoy herself. <laughs> I mean, good. I'm glad times have changed. I, I never actually thought about that. Like back in the day, it was just you know, you know, like the stock, the stock market. You know, they got them pumping the, those pumping dumps. You know. What I'm <laughs> <laughs> All right, right. God, they yeah. had started rubbing off on us. Jesus, rubbing off. Been on Tinder for about eight months. Why she got two lamps? Why does she need two lamps right there? It's two, <laughs> two lamps, two notepads, and two pens. She's getting all the numbers, bro. She needs double notepad. She's got two, two, at least two everything. She's got two feet. Ah! I like the ones with open smiles. <laughs> He's with his mother. So I don't think that that's a good idea. Oh, <laughs> a mom in the picture. No, thank you. <laughs> no, thank you. She likes the open mouth smile too. That's like the, um, that's like the male version of the duck face. You know, you get the girls, you get their big pouty lips, like, mm, you know, and then yeah. the guy version is the open mouth. <laughs> I'm just, <laughs> So hey. I feel like I just call some people out. They're like feeling self-conscious right now. Like, God dang, I do that all the time. I do it too. I mean, it is, but it, it's like, go look. <laughs> Especially like you go like influencer people you follow who seem to like the open mouth smile. Yeah. It's, they usually look like they got the thumbs up or something. They're taking the picture with the fan. Oh, like, yeah. You know, <laughs> I love younger men because they're in the middle of an achievement of a goal. There's the excitement of creating. I'm she loves the passion, you know. She's a, okay. a succubus. She's a succubus. Yeah, she likes the young men because oh yeah, they're all, all this energy, you know. I can feed off of it. <laughs> nah, she's a she. This this lady's got it happening, you know. I shoot. I'm kind of cool with it. I was about to say, you know, I hope we you know whenever I'm dead and gone and Mary's like, you know, a hundred years old because I'm gonna live to be at least, you know, ninety eight. Uh, <laughs> like she she can still be this full of life, but then at the same time, I was like, hmm, that's my wife. Stay, stay away from future younger <laughs> men. Yeah, leave her alone. She's, Mary, Mary's always like, if you die, I ain't nobody else. And I'm like, oh. And then she's like, but you, on the other hand, you're probably going to have like, another <laughs> girlfriend or something in like the same week. And I was like, geez, Mary. In the same like? week? Jesus. <laughs> it's like, golly, no, I'm not. Yeah. She's like, well, so statistically, I read that men, you know, move on. And I'm like, don't worry, Mary. <laughs> Can nobody replace you? Yeah. We're going to live forever anyway. We're immortal because we haven't died yet. It's proof. We're immortal. You Big know? facts. Big facts. And you are old. 
You got a birthday coming up, actually. That's pretty. That's pretty good. Yeah, yeah. Another one. Yeah, another, another, another birthday. I, I wasn't too sure how old I was. I had to refigure it up. Thirty-eight. Coming up on thirty-eight. <clears throat> no. Is it also it? brings me. Yeah, it also brings me up on uh like I was like, how long am I going to do YouTube? I wonder. And I was like, what if I just keep doing it forever? Just yeah. I'm gonna be like eighty years old. Like, all right, let's see what's. Oh my god, what are these YouTubers doing today? Just complain about. <laughs> The, new, oh, the yeah. new trends and stuff. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the video. Tall guy from Ecuador. And then after I say to him, by the way, how old are you? And he says, 19. <laughs> That's a yikes story. Chris Hansen was <laughs> on dick. <laughs> I just appreciate the fact that she, she moves quick. She like, she said they like her. Like, hey, what's up? You like me? Yeah. All right, let's go. Right. Go. Let's go get to it. You know, and then I gotta go get on my little back machine here and go pop my back because you know it's getting thrown out. <laughs> and I lie back. This provides circulation for everything, and it takes all the stress off. Oh, I am way too big for one of those. I hit that backflip, you know. I was gonna say mine would keep flipping; it would just be spinning. <laughs> just be spinning. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of the dynamics broke down, so we got divorced, and then he remarried, and I thought, and I'll remarry. And it didn't work that way, but I was horny. That's kind of the, that's kind of her whole theme, really, is that she talks right. about relationships and everything. It's just like, but we banging, we we sla we 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 getting it on, right? And then she's like, well, you know, we could date, but you know, I have this long list of people to go through here. You know what I mean? And like, <laughs> well, it's, there's nothing wrong with like, well, there's nothing wrong with it at all. But I was just noticing of like how much of a focus on the sexual aspects of it there is. Like, it's pretty much all it's about. <laughs> Well, no, well, kind of, right? Because she also likes the, she likes to be around the people that she feels like is just creating, right? Like achieving yeah, well, that, their goals and that energy. And but she says that, but then like when she says she meets them, they like each other and they go up to the room and then they're done, you know? It's <laughs> well, like, yeah, that's true. That's yeah, facts. <laughs> facts. The other, they left their names on my answering machine and I auditioned them. I wanted to keep having sex all the time, but... I didn't have a resident. <laughs> she interviewed these dudes. All right. She was in charge. Man, oh, MTV could have got in on that and made it a series, man. Like next, uh, I like you the, know? <laughs> I, I, I like, yeah, next. I like her, I like her, uh, her strategy here. Her strategy is not like date someone, get to know them, and then see if she can make a meaningful relationship out of it. It's if she can just blow their minds so hard with her skills that they want to stay with her. Right. That they want to marry her. Yeah, they're they're done laying in bed afterwards. She's like, so what? You want to marry me? And <laughs> so know, far, no success. <laughs> I was gonna say for some, that's probably not achievable. But you know what? It sounds like she's been putting in a lot of practice, so she might achieve this goal one day. Yep, yep. She she may do it. <laughs> Blow their minds. Emotional side was bad. I would mm. cry, and I was carrying on like that for decades. And I would get depression. It may never happen. I may die before it happens. Okay, so, okay, she talks about the emotional side there. It's not just the physicality of it, but... I, I, she knows better than me, right? I would say so, but I don't, it doesn't seem like a... If she's wanting more than just the sex part of it, it doesn't seem like she's setting herself up for success. Right. She also has a pull-up bar. Oh my God, she does. <laughs> Do you know she has the pull-up bar? Oh my, dude, this might be the most fit old 83-year-old lady in the world, dude. You better, we, we better watch it. I better stop talking about this. She's gonna... <laughs> She's she gonna add you to that list, Kitty. But you better watch, watch it. She gonna hit a couple of chin ups. That wasn't that, that thing that she was using. The, wasn't the back popper, you know, or circulation. That was that thing that Chuck Norris sells. You know, the infomercial, <laughs> like the, the full body gym or whatever the thing <laughs> yeah. was called. There you go. Yeah, Chuck Norris. They use this thing. You can be just like Chuck Norris. You know what if? Then what if? It's true. And the whole time we have all we all could have been gods like Chuck Norris by just using this body weight machine <laughs> i mean i i don't know i like i feel like that's on us and we as people have to accept that and take that l because we saw plenty of the infomercials act like you yeah, didn't see well, this yeah. on every single channel every single night so i came up with a psychological surgical procedure all right you cut the connection between your heart all right and your Bruh. she came up with that her, her lower regions ain't getting no blood, Dane. <laughs> it's ice cold. No wonder oh she can't keep a man. Oh, <laughs> oh man. 
it's like full foreplay, but all the time. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, but she you know she means emotionally. She means you know emotionally. Cut. Don't get attached and just go out there and bang. Which I mean, yeah, for what she's doing, it seems like the smart thing to do. Yeah, yeah. 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 I love she the line. Look at that layer, bro. She got that cut. Okay, I'm alright now. Tell me about the day you have coming up tonight. His name is Sean. I feel like I've seen this dude on another show before. Eh, I can't remember. And I'll probably give him a massage, and he's going to give me a massage. So there is the intimacy. Whether or not something will happen, I don't really know. We all know where massages go. Look at those back muscles. But she is using that thing. She is pulling up. My God. Yo, I know how it happened, too. She mistook somebody on, on Tinder. You know, so they, they swipe right and was like, hey, girl, pull up on me. And she goes, yo, don't worry. I'll pull up right now. <laughs> <laughs> and she just been there getting swole, dog. <laughs> If, you, if, if a dude's giving you a massage, there's only one reason. Dudes don't give nobody massages unless that's their profession. Unless they're trying to get something. All right? Right. <laughs> True. Like, oh, yeah. yeah oh, my, my best friend. He always gives me massages. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. Yeah. Once you told me you were in a dorm at NYU, and that, I thought, was pushing the limit. <laughs> <laughs> the NYU guys, right. Guys? <laughs> She was in a dorm. She, and then she showed up to someone's college. She's like, all right, boys, I'm here. Let's do this thing. <laughs> she's, she's like, yeah, I hooked up everybody on floor three. You know what I mean? Like, it was crazy. I haven't been too in tune with the older crowd or such. But, yeah, I would consider it a fantasy. It's a fantasy, all right. Yeah, yeah, How yeah. are you? <laughs> she's so giddy. Like, she, I don't think she answered him. She was just like, <laughs> Another Got him soul. here. <laughs> I will live forever. <laughs> so I miss making love. Which is crazy because you're you're an amazing person. So yeah. yeah. Mm, yes, I am. I am very amazing indeed. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what else, what other hobbies she has. Like what else? I mean, she's she's lived a full life, right? Yeah. But I, I kind of wonder like what she talks about when she's there. Or she's like, hey, thank you for joining me. So. This is a crazy story. Let me tell you all about this, man. I went down to the, the college, you know. There was like 20 dudes there. Let me tell you what I did. <laughs> you know, and then they go, hmm. <laughs> right. Mm, all right. Mm, well, uh. <laughs> mm. I'm down, Grandma. Let's go. <laughs> also, I like about Hattie was her bubbling personality and how genuine she is. She's just a people person. The date went well. Um, it's an interesting dynamic. He's outside, though. He didn't go up to the hotel. Uh -oh. They're going to interview Hattie. Maybe that's after. Like, She's gonna, she's gonna interview her. He's like, that son of a guy need what is he leaving? Stir me up. <laughs> that I'll probably have him massage me. And I'll massage him. And <laughs> Oh. Who you know? That's that's her that's her trick. Well, you know, I'll have a massage, you know. Yes, that's the way in, all right. All right. That's aging. It's okay with me. I'm gonna take oh, you know, it. I'm gonna do these Dang. things. I'm gonna claim she got the medicine ball? <laughs> She got the medicine ball out. She's got her the shakes. She's older, man. Out. Yeah, she's more fit than me. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I'm kind of jealous, honestly. <laughs> Here we you go. Ever, you ever been to New York? No. Never no. planned to either. <laughs> Never planned like, on going. I'm like two hours away or something. I, I I get this. I met I met a lot of people here who are like from New York, and I just get that vibe, man. People are just different there. You know what I mean? Different? You mean? I mean, is that, is that, <laughs> I'm just saying, I don't think that this, I don't think she's looked at as very weird where she's at. Is all. It's not like they're actually bad people, <laughs> but just out in public, you know, that people just in the city, they're just mean. They're like, get my way, you know? Right. It's where if you're down back home, you know, where you come from, someone said that, you'd be like, excuse me, smack, you know? <laughs> <laughs> the guy behind the register who's working there would be like, what'd you say to that customer right there? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, boy, I got a, my, my review's coming up. I'm about to fight for this man. <laughs> Oh, man, that, that's actually more wholesome than I thought it was going to be, honestly. But yeah. yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Leave a comment, leave a like, do all that cool stuff. Today's your birthday. Happy birthday. Stay toast, my friends. We'll see you next time. I love you. Bye-bye.